my co-worker saw my planner and she said she needed something like that in her life so i decided to make this <laughs> Hey y'all, this is Kendra from Kendra the Plan. And if you're new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you're returning, thank you for coming back. I really appreciate you today. We're gonna be doing something for somebody else, not me. We are going to be creating a half litter planner for my coworker. She is currently um, in school, works full time, and as a mom of four. So I'm gonna create this half litter planner for her. I have a ton of stuff here from cloth and paper, something from Love Love Posh, um, some mini happy planner discs. I'm gonna put it on mini discs because I'm just doing October, November, December. And I'm gonna take this to her tomorrow at work. So I wanna go ahead and get this put together. So let's go ahead and get started. I'll try to name the things that I'm using as I go. I decided, originally I was gonna do gold mini happy planner discs. I'm gonna do black. These are plastic, it's okay. You guys know I love metal, but all I had available to me was black. And I don't, I only had eight. I mean, I only had seven, not eight. So I had to pull one off of a planner. Now I'm trying to open this ring. This is how I keep my um, disc together on these rings, but this one won't open. There we go. Okay. So we're gonna start it off with these mini discs. Majority of this stuff I got from cloth and paper. Um, I do have a haul video up of me buying a lot of it. And um, I did use reward points for most of it. So we're going to start off with this cover. This is, is, it says notes, but again, this is just like a temporary planner. And if she really likes it, her and I decided, then we will put a real planner together for her for 2024. So I'm gonna go ahead and take the film off of this. At least I'm gonna try to. How are you guys doing today? Hopefully this won't be a long one. I'm really hungry. <laughs> I need to go eat dinner. So, and of course it doesn't come off the edges. Don't do that. Anyways. Keeping it moving, I'm gonna take the film off of here too. I probably should have took the film off prior to the video, but I didn't want that glare to mess up the video, which it probably still will because I didn't take a photo. But yes, my coworker, um, she seen and heard about me being into planners. And she came and talked to me. Um, she doesn't work in my, I guess, department or division. So um, she came and saw me and we kind of talked for a while about planners, what I use them for, what I put in them. Um, she, We talked about sizes. I showed her, the first thing I showed her was, you know, a classic size. She was like, nope, don't want that. Okay, cool, no problem. Um, <laughs> so then she was like, that was too big. So then I showed her my mini planner and she said that was too small. And then um, I showed her a classic and she was like she didn't like that shape or or whatever so then I said well there's a half letter I said there's one that's bigger than this mini smaller than the HP classic as a and I'm I'm planning on using it eventually I don't use it right now and she was like yeah I'll do I'll try that so that's where we're starting is with the half letter There we go. So that's where we're gonna start. And then I have this dashboard. I have a ton of stuff on my desk right now. I have this dashboard that says work in progress. So I figured this would be perfect to go right here, smack dab in the front. Now, can you see that, that note? Sorry for the glare, but how it has that notes going across and then this shape. I thought that is so, so pretty. And that's why I chose black disc. Okay, so let's start with 
let's start with the monthly. Where is it? Okay, so what I did was I got 2023 uh, months. And I'm just going to use October, November, and December. Okay, here we go. So this is this like um it's kind of like a dashboard kind of not this is october it has the monthly here and then it just goes straight into the next month so we're going to start with october and then for her weeklies these are undated weeklies there's a time block section in there which you mentioned wanting a time block section that's why i chose this one and I'm going to see how many weeks there are there in October. Let me count. One, two, three, four. Okay, there's there's four, but then there's a section. And I'm, I'm sitting in my squeaky chair. Sorry if you guys hear a bunch of noise in the background of squeaking. So one, two, three. boom straight like that and then the next month would go in here which would be November but I want to put obviously I want to put something to separate them so I have these side tab dividers these clear ones from um coffee paper so I'm gonna just pull off the one off top like so nope don't like that let's put this in the front because I want this to say October um So let's move it here. There we go. October, and then we can do the next one, which would be November. And then I'm just gonna use, sorry. I'm just gonna use stickers to put what month it is. And then the last one would be December. So this is November. This is going to be the uh, intro section, notes, goals, intentions, bills due. Then her November monthly. And then we're going to put how many weeks are in November? One, two, three, four, five weeks. So we're going to count out five weeks again. One, two, three. Four. Uh oh. I need one more. And why is there grid paper in between each one? Do I have to keep the grid paper? I guess so. I didn't realize that's that was a thing. I could always tape those together for her if she doesn't like that. I don't like that. Um. Y'all, do not tell me I just ran out of weeks. How many weekly schedules did I get then? Am I bugging? One week? It's only two months worth and not three months worth? Three. So I have a monthly for December, but I do not have a weekly schedule. But I can add in some daily sheets somewhere okay so in the december section i'm gonna add in some daily sheets for her i cannot believe i did not do the weekly get enough weeklies that is just beyond me hopefully she likes these daily sheets i'm so sorry me okay 
And then she really could just tell me which layout she likes the most. Okay, so that is gonna be that section. Then we can do I need something for notes. So here are some type of dashboard dividers. Task, to do, get it done, check it off, daily digest, meetings and notes. I need this one for something else. Set that one aside. So I'm thinking maybe task or to do. We can separate this section. And we can add in passwords, contact list, birthdays. Let's do that. And then I got her just some straight up note taking paper, okay? And she's currently in school. I, I think I already said this, but she's currently in school. So I'm hoping this note taking paper is gonna be helpful for her. I think it will be. Probably should have put it in half, but it's cool. There it is. Okay, we need something. To separate this I guess maybe daily digest and then it can go over this embossed one I kind of want this to go in the front though there's luxury and simplicity I have that dashboard what is important is seldom urgent and what is urgent is seldom important Ooh. That one's cute. That one's really cute. Okay. How do you guys like your stuff broken up? Because I need something here. There's just luxury and simplicity. Maybe we'll just go with that. What do you guys think? Let me know. And then there's this. I really wanted this to go in the front because I love it so much. And I might end up moving it because I wanted to try to give her like a cute little layering number. And then I need a divider. Like top tab divider. So then that's what I'm going to use some of my Live Love Posh top tab dividers. I have like multiple packs of these. So these are going to be the monthlies, right? Oh, and then I got this specifically for her. It is, says intentional planning. Um, use a notebook, calendar, keep a planner, end of the day. I wanted this to go in the front for her. Let me, let me get this one back. There's luxury and simplicity. Let's take that one out. I'll make this one say daily digest like that okay and then we can because i wanted there to be a cute layer piece for her unless i put it here what do you guys think sorry for all the noise i'm just trying to Oh, no, that's what it needed to. Oh, this is nice. I love this layering number. Okay, and then intentional planning. There we go. Now we're talking. Okay, let's put a divider here. And then we can say what it is. Weekly schedule. 
have to put this divider on top of it, right? And let's see what we can put here. Weeklies, is there a weekly? Weekly, right here. Well, the thing is, I want her to know that she has monthlies too. But I'm gonna put a month on the side. So we'll say weekly here. Okay, I like that. And then I have some dated stickers. We'll do the dated in a minute. Let's go away from here. And let's do daily. Because these are where the daily sheets start. Daily. Okay, and then we're we'll going to this last section here. I guess these last two sections. I kind of want this to be. Yeah, let's take this out. Let's add this divider here. And maybe add this little number here. Okay. This one just has like her birthdays, her passwords, and a few notes in here. So I don't know what we should call. Oh, passwords. There's a tab that says passwords. Perfect. I really hope she likes this, you guys. Oops. Here we go, passwords. And then the last, but certainly not least, this will be notes. Is there a notes on here? Oops, yep, there's a notes. Okay, this has come together really, really well. Um, also, I wanted to mention, I'm gonna be giving it to her in one of these duster bags. And you guys know I've been collecting these for a little minute here. So I'm gonna give her um, some time blocks, dots, or some dot stickers. I pulled out some time block stickers. I don't know where I put them. But I'm just gonna be throwing like a few things in here that she can have as well. Um, for her planner, I'm going to give her one of these clips from coffin paper as well. I'm trying to see, should I, should I layer this on the front? Would that be cute? Give her a cute layering moment up front. Let's see. For a pop of color. This is gonna be so cute. I can't believe, what did I do with those time block stickers? Did I already put them in here? No. All right, here's some time block stickers. I'm gonna throw these in the duster bag as well with the dot stickers. Everything's gonna end up going in here all together. She now has a clip that she's gonna be able to clip everything together right now. I just have it as a layering moment because she hasn't gotten started on her days. And then I'm just gonna use this dated sticker book from uh, Mojo Jojo Plans. And there's like divider dates in here somewhere. Here they go. And that's what I'm gonna put on these dividers just to make it simple, quick, and easy. So I have October here. And I probably should turn it to the side, All right? I have October. I'm gonna have to cut the ends off a little bit, but that's okay. Then we're gonna do November.
and December. I am super, super, super excited to introduce her fully into my world. And I really, really hope that this planner is as useful and brings you as much joy as it does for me. So this is going to be the half letter planner that I created for my coworker. Okay, so I'm gonna redo the ending of this video. Um, this is the planner that I put together all, all the way. So I'm putting it, it's coming in this duster bag and sorry for the glare. It has this notes numbering piece right here with these beautiful dashboards as the intentional planning has this cute little layering number piece right here. Love that. So she can have that clip. Then we go into her weeklies. She currently has a weekly schedule or has her monthly and then goes into her weeklies. Of course, they're undated. Then we have November does the same thing that October does. December, I only have monthlies because I ran out of sheets. It's okay. I can get her more at a later date. There's her monthly. Then it goes into a daily section with a divider here that says daily digest. And these have all undated daily sheets. Then I gave her a password section. This password section has this cute divider here. I'm sorry, dashboard right here. And then it just has her passwords, websites, username, password, and then contact list. And then lastly, I gave her this note section with this divider, task and to do's, get it done, check it off. I added in these sticky notes right here and I gave her like three or four of each side so she can have that to use in this note taking section. I put it on this embossed dashboard and then these are just plain note pages. So that is the entire planner. I pray and hope that she loves this. I absolutely love this V. I cannot wait to give this to you at work tomorrow. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you do, please give it a thumbs up. Should you have it in your heart, please hit that subscribe button. As always, you guys, stay positive, be blessed. Love y'all. Peace.